Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I am off. So it's gonna be a lot of running around, getting things done around the house, as well as running some errands to help improve upon the house and make some plans for the next week or so. Henry's really interested in my new stand, so I'm gonna try to keep him away from it. Where are you going? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, so we got a wash sheets. We have to go grocery shopping. I looked up a Lift 4 meal plan that we plan on doing to prepare for Lift 4 that starts on October 1st. And I need to get my kid right now because you can see what he's trying to do. Stop ruining mommy's drive on! Children. So, we're gonna go ahead, go to Trader Joe's this time and get some groceries for that meal plan. And then we might go to the park to burn off some energy. Um, but we're just gonna bring you guys along today. I have a list of everything else that I'll kind of tell you throughout the day, but I need to get this camera away from this toddler and get going for the day. Okay, so we already ate breakfast, already brushed our teeth, I need to brush your hair again. I don't want that in my mouth. Just talk to you soon. Someone's being silly. Who's <laughs> 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 a silly cooper? <laughs> I love you. <gasps> so close. Too close. Okay, let's go. <laughs> okay, so before we were about to leave, I remembered that I need to get my back tires on my car looked at. So I have to call um, our local tire shop and see when they have an appointment available. And that will kind of really be what our day revolves around. So prior to doing that, I just wanted to come outside and hang with our little pups. And Henry loves coming out here and just being outside with them. He has a swing out here and then just being around the puppies. As long as they're not in his face too much, he'll love it. I'm sorry, but he keeps knocking the camera. Um, but that's really it. Let's call and let's get going. Okay, so I called up the tire place and they basically said if you can come here right now, we'll hopefully get you in and out within the next hour. So I was like, I am coming right away because other than that, it'll be a two plus hour wait and that is not gonna be fun. So we are gonna get our butts there. We got some snacks in our hands already. And then he's already drinking a ton of milk and I got treats here, so let's get to it. Okay guys, so we are back from Trader Joe's and I just wanted to show you all what we got. Um, I was able to get Henry right up to bed as soon as we got back at around 10 a.m. And I checked on him and he is fast asleep. And then I moved the wash, the sheets over from the washer to the dryer. So we're doing well so far today. And then the tire place told me I need three new tires. So we're gonna look into some tire deals and then go get some of those, uh, hopefully early next week. But this is what we got. Um, I think I did pretty well. Every time I go to Traders, I always get a bit more than what I was gonna go there for initially. But that's fine, it's a bit healthier out of all the stores. So over here are really Kirk's treats. Then we have our greens and all of this is based off the Lift 4 meal plan that I downloaded off Pinterest. Got our bananas for the week and some more yellow ones to eat immediately. Got a large container of strawberries because I'm gonna make some overnight oats. Blueberries for the Henny Man. And more of the recipe stuff. Uh, this is the first time I'm trying the riced cauliflower from there because a lot of the Lift 4 recipes had it in it. So we'll see how that goes. I don't have a food processor to make it on my own, nor do I want to just yet. <laughs> and then we have this asparagus risotto, which I thought would be nice if one day I'm not feeling well or anything. Just good to have. Uh, we needed more milk. I have to get milk for um, his daycare that he goes to. So this is probably gonna go to his daycare. We got our egg whites, cause some of the recipes call for that. More gluten-free bread, we're always getting that. Eggs, these, um, they're the Trader Joe's brand of like Nutri-Grain bars. Henry loves them. 
Then we got these. I'm pretty excited about these for wraps. Our habanero lime flour tortillas. Um, some little Joe O's for Henry to snack on while I'm making meals. Uh, the three buck chuck, Cabernet. Uh, just some tomato sauce. I love this coconut oil spray from them. That's what I always use. Our big gallon of organic milk. This is for Kirk's trips. He loves this, so I always try to get it for him. So I just fell behind here. And I do love these on some chicken with some noodles. It's so good. And some olive oil. It's a complete meal with some pasta. So definitely love that every time I get there. I actually stocked up on a lot of meat, even though we only really needed two packs. Um, but about a month ago, our fridge broke down, so I lost all of my stockpile. So I'm slowly trying to get that back up because it's a lot easier to have some things in there in case you don't want to go out to the store. And it's cheaper once you have a stockpile built up. Some red potatoes, a little bit more of the LaCroix, and then their salsa is amazing. It is a bit spicy. But this stuff is like, like anytime I go there, I do stock up on it. But I already had four bottles of salsa or jars of salsa in our pantry. So I wasn't going to get too much. And then I am doing no sugar this next week. So this is all for Kirk. Um, but when I go there, I do get his favorite dark chocolate peanut butter cups. Um, so I'm going to have to stay away from those. That is super tempting. I'm kind of mad at myself for getting it. And then his RX bars for his trip. But that that is it. So the plan now is to go ahead and work out while he's napping. Um, and then I'm going to have to call my dad because he actually signed up for Beachbody. So I got to kind of walk him through what the next steps are. My mom did too. She signed up for the shakes. So I want to kind of guide her and make sure they're getting the most out of this. Um, and then I have a few other leads to follow up on. Uh, after that, Henry should be awake and then we will go out. I wanted to go to Hobby Lobby to get some larger mason jars for the overnight oats because I have really small ones and I think it's just going to be a mess if I try to do them in there. And then I do need to go to Home Depot because there's a few house projects we need to work on, like something <laughs> to prevent this from happening to our door because my son likes to take off all of the little springs on the bottom and there's some other projects I just need to prioritize what we want to do first okay but I'll take you guys along cardio fix got a good sweat up my new sport bra from pineapple clothing was amazing kept everything in place um, but now i'm trying to eat a little bit of lunch before henry wakes up i just checked on him i'm gonna try these lucroy curanis that croaker just got for me because it wasn't available on the click list the mango ones that i requested and then i already took a bite but i'm just having a turkey sandwich basically but on a habanero wrap with spinach tomato avocados and a little bit of mayo um and uh, a little bit of cheese in here just to make it super yummy so hopefully i can scarf this down and then prioritize my list and clean up before he wakes up mm. henry is finally up from his nap so he woke up probably about one o'clock so he slept for almost three hours this is one of those times where you go in and you're like, you're breathing, right? And he's breathing and he's happy. Uh, so after he woke up, we went ahead, got him some garlic chicken 
uh, veggie pasta that was leftovers from the other night. He ate a ton of that with some blueberries, FaceTimed Kirk's mom for a little bit because she's interested in Shakeology. And now we are at our jewelry store uh, that Kirk kind of gets everything for me. Gonna get my rings clean, get it back to the pair of earrings that um, he got me that I lost the back for. And then we're gonna go to Hobby Lobby and relax a little bit. I love that store, so I'm gonna have some fun in there. I just hope Henry is good for all of it. I made sure he was fed. We got snacks with us. Mama wants to shop a little bit, okay? Let's get to it. Hobby Lobby was extremely disappointing. There wasn't anything like furniture wise for the office. I was looking for a bookshelf because we have to move everything over for the new guest bed that we're getting in there for my friend. So we literally just got the mason jars and then we went to the dollar store to get a new dish brush because I hate using sponges anymore. I just find them gross. And Henry will not let the brush go since we got it. <laughs> uh, so last stop, Home Depot, then we're going to go back home. Hopefully he'll take a quick nap. I'll make dinner and then we're going to hang out with the pups and maybe go to the park once he wakes up. So fingers crossed. Let's have some fun. Where are you going? My keys back. Thank you. No, we have to pay for that. <laughs> our Home Depot adventures while we wait for our bathroom paint. <sighs> okay, buddy, let's get going. Mom, mom, mom. We are back, and it's time to play. With the puppies. Hi, Neo. Hi, Henry. Can I have my fork? No. No, you have something else to play with. Thank you. Hi. <laughs> this is why it's called Mego and the Boys. Oh. So we got some paint for our downstairs gold everything bathroom. So I'm really hoping that this turns out nice. It's just like a light blue. So I'm gonna try it real quick and show you guys what it looks like. Okay, so we started working on our gold everything bathroom. We are looking to paint it this light blue color and go over the gold wallpaper. Sorry, let it focus that we have in here. And then we gotta paint the vanity a uh, white color. So, we'll see how it looks after this one for like the barn, barn or farmhouse look. So we'll see. So that is it for the night. I got Henry to sleep and then I taped off our guest bathroom to get it ready to finish painting tomorrow and hopefully paint the actual uh, vanity. So we'll see. Now I am going to relax and drink my Pennsylvania beer, Yangling, and watch some Halloween baking championship because I don't wanna eat that stuff, but I love baking, so we'll see. I have to do a week without sugar for my sister's accountability group. We'll see how that goes, but cheers to a good Saturday. Can't wait to have family back and everything like that. Um, if you guys like this video, thumbs up or subscribe and make sure you have the bell notification turned on if you subscribe so you're alerted to new videos that I'm posting. Thanks guys. Bye.